Well, hello everyone, and you joined me in a part of the world which I don't think I've shown for quite a while, so many of you may not have seen it. They're justified, and they're ancient. Welcome to Moo Moo Land. Yeah, this is a mushroom island biome. It's one of the places we discovered quite early, to be totally honest with you. And the reason why I'm here is because I want to do some stuff with um, sea temples this time round. Probably in the next episode as well, because it's probably going to be too much for me to do in 20 minutes. But uh, we found this quite early and then found quite quickly after it uh, a sea temple, which a group of three of us went in and basically cleared the place out. Which I And since then I've been coming in there periodically and taking some of the resources out of it. Unfortunately, it's completely... Well, it's not completely, but... All the internal sea lanterns are gone, and the external ones have been going out and fighting things in order to get, and I don't particularly want to do that. So I've decided it's time to do... to go and do another sea temple, and this time I'm going to have a crack at doing it myself. Now this might end as complete disaster, in fact it probably will. But hey, complete disasters make good YouTube, don't they? But anyway, this journey I'm just going to speed up a little bit, so just let me say... Oh, there you go. You can see in the distance now. Oh, I should just stop there we go. All right. Um, you can just see in the distance now the lights, the remaining few lights of the old sea temple there, and that is where I've been clearing out for quite a while. I'll just stick our noses in there quickly so you can see what's going on, but uh, it's not really worth going into much anymore. But uh, just let me show you this place. So, one of, the, one of the first things I did here was just create myself an air passage in. We basically just cleared out all the water in the sea temple and have been mining resources. All the lights, as you can see down here, are gone. They're one of the first things that went and if you go down further in the base you find that there's a lot of this has just been cleared out now and uh, eventually it will all go you know, whenever we need something green, we come here, we get loads of blocks, we move on. But I don't want to dwell on this one just yet. I want to instead have a little look down here. Because about 300 blocks in this way I have found on the map. A, I, there lies another sea temple. And... Oh, you wouldn't believe the fun I had putting this this particular passageway in. These, these, the Sea Guardians don't do that much damage, but they do a lot of knockback. Oh, sorry, there I got a a, a, a sudden phone call, which was a, a little bit <laughs> a little bit disconcerting. I'll probably cut most of it out, but uh, yeah, sorry about that. Getting close here. Um, you can see I've made another platform out here and you can now see the lights and there is a brand new sea temple and this is where we are going to be um, playing around today now let's just just pop our noses down the bottom there the first thing we need to do is get inside but now as you can see mining fatigue which means it's almost impossible to actually mine things. But I have a theory. I have a theory which might be fun. And my theory is that uh, mining fatigue is not going to affect TNT. So what I'm thinking here is let's blow a hole in the top, shall we? 
So that's what we're going to start off with. And go away. Yeah, I'm starting to attack the ascension of the guardians now, which is great. So let's get some equipment on our bar. I right, we'll want that to start off with. So one, two, three. Now we'll put the TNT there. Let's get some TNT here. I brought brought a little bit along just in case this turned out to be fun. So we'll put some TNT there, and I think if we put some sand on top of it, the TNT will fall, the sand will fall on top of it. I don't know this. I think this. Let's find out, shall we? So, here we go. No! <laughs> that was a good start, wasn't it? All right, let's try that again. I think the sand might have made a, uh, made things a bit harder there. Yeah, and these guys are going to make things harder still. But let's see if we work around this. Um, all right, so let's uh, get some of these on the bar. And this is the reason why I'm wearing my Sunday best armor. Rebuild this quickly. <laughs> yeah, I should have known this wouldn't have quite worked, but I, I had to try it. I had to try it at least once. So there we go. A bit more TNT. Okay, and just to uh, because the last time, let's just do that. I. I should imagine that sand has fallen down the bottom there, hasn't it? Yes, it has. Well, there we are. Let's see what happens. All right, fingers crossed. That one. Fell down the bottom. Yeah, that fell down the bottom, but this sand... Okay, what we need to do, okay, is uh, surround it. Surround the explosion, otherwise the water won't work. It will, it will just blow up adjacent things. So let's get some sand going down here. Alright, so we'll just put some sand down here. Like this. Keep the eye on oh, the breath. Let's get up the top. Get the breath, there we go. And back down again. So that's where the TNT will fall. So... I think what we'll do this time is let's actually do it down here. So let's get another breath. I thought I was being clever for putting it down here, but that didn't really work, did it? So let's stick a bit of TNT in. Like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to light it. And then we're going to get out of here. And how did that work? That did absolutely nothing. Right, piece of TNT, light it. No. Okay. I think I'm going to have to go back to the drawing board on this one. I thought that was going to work, but it clearly isn't. So. What we're going to want to do is go in, I think, ooh, there we go, the time is, uh, We need. I think what we need to do here is go in through the front door. So let's back off for a sec, let's get away from the Guardians. I was hoping we were going to be able to blow a hole in through the top, but I'm not quite working that one out. So that plan hasn't worked. I'm going to keep the sand for a bit, just in case. But what I want to do is I want to make myself um, some bits and pieces. So first things first, let's put let's put uh, crafting bench down. I'm never going to be able to pick this one up, so that's there for now. Well, I'm going to be able to pick it up once the uh, mining fatigue runs out, but not before. So let's make ourselves some bits and pieces here and. Um, what I want to do is I want to make myself some doors. Okay, we'll start off with those. I think I'll sacrifice a pile of sand because that didn't quite work out as well as I wanted. 
and we're going to put some potions onto our toolbar here. So night vision, um, water breathing, and later on I will put a strength one in my bar for when the big fight starts. So let's go back. Do you see the lights down there? That's the entrance. So if plan A doesn't work, let's go with plan B. I'm actually starting to wish I brought some regeneration potions with me, but you can't have everything. Actually, I've forgotten something. I haven't eaten, so let's get some food on our bar and try this again. Okay, yeah. Yeah, those guardians are persistent, aren't they? Okay, food. Not going to need a shovel because of the mining fatigue, so... Nom, 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 nom. Right, that'll heal me up as we're going along. Okay, so that's where we're going. I'm not going to run over there. I'm actually just going to attack this diagonally. So the first thing I'll do is take the night vision. And the second thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the water breathing. And I'm just going to chuck those because... I, last time I did this, I had a real problem with the fact that uh, when I tried to get in here, what was happening was uh, I accidentally drank a water bottle instead of a potion of water breathing because they look so similar. Let's see if I can get in here. There we go. Right, now the first thing I want to do is I want to block this area off, which I'm going to do with the doors. That's going to stop them from hitting me. I can't get through here though, can I? Um, but I now have a refuge, so I'll open those doors and that gives me an air pocket. If anything goes wrong, I have the air pocket. Let's go down a little bit, see if I can get in there. I can't get in there. I need to find the entrance, so let's go looking for the entrance. I have a nasty feeling that was the entrance. And if that's the case, we're going to have to open it up a little bit by the looks of it. So let's go and see what we can do. Down we go. Okay, so here we are through here. Let's close the doors so they lose interest in us out there. And what can we do to get in here? Well, of course, I've got a lot of TNT with me. So let's give that a try, shall we? So. TNT and sand. So TNT, sand, 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 sand. Hopefully this is going to help us uh, provide a um, an entrance. We'll see. Okay, so that. That and we're almost in. Okay, let's block that out quickly. Okay, I uh, don't want any sea guardians swimming up on me, so let's just clear that area out a bit. That's just there. There's a mining fatigue again, but now actually this is nice because it's working. We know it's working. Can we get in there? No, we can't get in there. So what we're going to do is we're going to do exactly the same thing again. Um, so get that out, put that in, get that out. Oh, wrong one. Put that in. Okay, so let's raise that a little bit higher. So what we'll do is do there. And we'll put sand here and here. And let's just surround the thing with sand. There we go. And what we'll do is we'll light that and we'll put a last sand block in front of it. And then retreat to a safe distance. You see, they're still hitting me through there. I suppose I could actually put some blocks up, and I think I will, but let's do this first. So, light, sand, retreat, and we're in! Okay, step one is complete. So, first of all, let's get some blocks in here. Let's get a bit of a defensive area because what we don't want is to be up to our elbows in Guardians. So, let's just stick some some cobblestone around here there's our first one you see go away 
There we go, and back to the old cobblestone. Defensive perimeters. There we go, and there, and there, and let's put a couple of doors in here. Right, put that on the wrong side. There we go, one there, and one there. There we go, that'll do. Okay, so we now have a defensive area, and what I'm thinking about it, just pop that there. Oh, that's where they were getting to me from, was it? Oh, that's nice. Okay, so, right, let's start exploring the area, shall we? Get a bit of food on my bar. I have a bit of food on my bar. Oh, look at this. Sea Latins. Okay, so we are... Our first goal is in sight, so let's stick a door there. And I now need to make some more doors, so let's go and make ourselves a quick um, workbench. How are we doing for potions? We're doing alright for potions. I think I'm going to put a couple more on my bar, just in case. But the nice thing now is that we have um, a lot of places to hide, you know, places with oxygen. So if worst comes to worst, I thought I saw, okay, worst comes, yeah I did, I did, I did see I saw a sea guardian, there he goes, off he goes, right, okay, we'll come back and deal with him later on. So there we go, right, so, ah, <laughs> oh nice, okay, so we're, we're sealing this area off and we're doing it piece by piece. And that's going to make us the winners in the long run. So let's just seal that off. There we go. And you know, actually the explosions and that are causing some air pockets which are really useful for us. Um, I could probably use them to make a chest up here and start and storing my, storing my loot really, couldn't I? So let's do that now. Uh, yeah, which one of those? And that will create us a chest let's swap that with the flint and steel hopefully we won't need that again but uh right let's open that up stick some sand i want to keep the prismarine i don't want to carry it around with me though and let's put a potion of water breathing there and let's put a potion of night vision there um what else don't we need i don't think we need those slabs and yeah, oh, I don't think we'll need the TNT. I can come back for that if I need it. So if I don't need that, I don't need the front and steel. There we go, sorted. That gives us a bit more space. And that gives us a bit more freedom to uh, explore stuff. Uh, night vision's about to run out. Water breathing's about to run out. So I'll tell you what, let's top those up at this point. So night vision. And if you look... Oh, it didn't drink it completely. There we go. You see it changes to another blue potion, which is really annoying. And we'll give that a few seconds. There we go. Now we'll take the water breathing. There you go. And I don't want those water po poles. So let's get rid of those. Okay, let's plunge on and see what we can do. Eh? Right, so let's close that door. Gives us a breathing space, you see. And let's look around here. Hello. And another one bites the dust. Okay, so let's block off a bit. Let's block the doors off here. And let's look in here. Hello. Alright, um, if the spikes are out, they got thorns, which is a bit worrying, but uh, it's not the end of the world. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to block it off here. So let's put another set of doors here. Like that. And that gives us one area to look in. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come back, Harold. Come back. I think this is where we tried to get in in the first place, so we might do something with that later on. But uh, what I want to do is I want to go and look, have a look down here. First off, I think that's the guy. Yeah. That's, that's one of our goals. That's full of gold. So we'll have a bit of that. 
So these guys are starting to get a bit common now. But still, they're easily defeatable. As long as you don't get too many of them around you. And I think actually we'll do another set of doors here. I know probably looking at these doors is getting a bit boring. But it's going to be really helpful in the long run. And actually I think I want to mark that as well. So let's just put... Alright, so... Exit! Because the last thing we want to do is get confused. And there's another airspace for us if we need it. So... He's one of the bosses. Let's get rid of him. You make me nervous, but quite frankly, as a sponge, that would be really useful. And you. That's one guardian down, two to go. Okay, so that wasn't actually the exit. What's down here? Apart from him. They've got a good uh, attack attitude, haven't they? Run away, then turn around to fight. Okay, so I think I need to start blocking some of this off because I am starting to get lost. I went through the wrong door and I marked the wrong thing as the exit. So first of all, let's get back out there. Okay, as the mining fatigue again, let's check our night vision and water breathing. We've got, we've got plenty thereof. And I wanted to go make some more doors, so presumably the doors are through them. This is wrong as well. Okay, a little bit lost here. I think I might actually cut out and at the very least give you a, a quick montage of me scrabbling around trying to find out where I am. Yeah, let's do that, shall we? Quick montage time. Well, that was easy. I just went through the wrong door. Okay. Right, we're back here, and there's a couple of bits and pieces I want to make now. So the first thing I want to do is let's make ourselves a quick furnace. And the reason for that is we're going to start claiming this area as our own. And we're going to do that by using this sponge. So let's open this up. We'll put the sponge in there. In there rather and we'll stick a piece of coal in there and that will cook that sponge that will dry that sponge out okay and I wanted to make some doors so 8 12 yeah well no, 16 20 24 let's make more doors because I'm using a lot of them so running out short of wood but uh, I think it's paying off well uh, okay so there we go that's that sponge is now like that, and I think I can just use it. There you go, and it's just sucked in um, a load of the water. This air area is now airbound, and now if I if I could dig this up, uh, because I still have mining fatigue, but uh, I, I now have a, an emergency area I can come to if I really want to. In fact, thinking about that, let's see. How are we doing for night vision and... Oh, water breathing so we'll stick that one there and we'll stick that one there I have one more night water breathing and I have one more night vision when those run out that's the end of this assault I need to get out 
but what we will do is we will come back and uh, a second episode and finish this off. I don't think I'm going to get this done today, so let's get on, shall we? Um, have a nice soggy steak before we continue. So, so far it's me, one Outer Guardian, the Outer Guardian's nil. But uh, I think we kind of carry on narrowing those odds. What I want to do is get up to the top first off. There he is. Steal that little one first. And I'm finding I'm not needing. I packed some potions of strength thinking they might help in here. And I'm to be honest with you, I'm not needing them. So there we go. Elder Guardians 2. There is one more Elder Guardian left in here. And that's my warning that these are running out. So let's take an ocean of night vision. And let's take a potion of water breathing. And before we forget, let's get those out of my bar and let's put the proper ones in. When I take that last one, we're out of here. So that's two outer guardians. Let's have a little hunt through here. Okay, this is how we got in. So let's put some doors here to say that we've gone through here. Like that. And go back to base. We're going to stick that wet sponge back into there. So let's open that up. New wet sponge. New piece of coal. Just cook that wet sponge down. I want to get this area cleared out if I can do it. And later on, we'll be working a lot with these wet spon these sponges. To uh, what we'll do is we'll we'll just clear this, this area completely out of there like that. Right, we now have air we can breathe. Which, let's face it, is going to help us a lot. And there's our mining fatigue again. So let's get back to it, shall we? Right, there's I've done the top one done the one over this side so I'm willing to bet I'm gonna to have to go over to the far end of the temple to get the last one and in case anyone's wondering though I have no idea where they are I got completely and utterly lost the last time I did this um, I really and I mean painfully lost so let's put some doors in here okay um, another Another hidey hole. Ignore these guys. Uh, you, however, I'm going to victimise. And now you've run away from me. That works for me. You've run away from me. That works for me. You, however, I don't like your face. So... Right, wherever this is, this is not filled with Elder Guardians. Come back. Thank you. Alright, let's have a look. Loads of time on the uh, air, and I've got plenty of doors to put down if worst comes to worst. So let's keep on following us around the bottom. Because I get the feeling this is going to be to where the next Elder Guardian is. Alright, okay, now if we look up here. I think we've been in this area. Stick some more doors down here just in case. Like that. See more breathing space. Death to that one. That one's no good to me. Let's block it off. You see how this is going to work. Um, and if, if worst comes to very worst, I think I can survive this area with going from doorway to doorway. It's this area. That's nothing. What's this area? Right, that's an area I haven't been into. How do I get in there? Can't get in there like that because of. Uh, Mining fatigue, four minutes of uh, breathe, water breathing left, and one more set of potions. Let's grab a, uh, a steak. Okay, we're good there. 
Keep on looking around. Okay, that's all good. We know we blocked all that off. Let's stick some doors here. Just because we can. There we go. Cut the doors. Let's have a look around the other side of here. That area is no good to us. Ah, this looks like it opened. Um, oh, we've been here once already. Okay, I think we're getting a bit turned around now. But there's an... Is that an entrance way we have been before? No, we've been here once already. But... I don't think we've been up enough. Come on. That's not the way. So it's just a case of hunting around now and finding the last Sea Guardian. Which is... I've probably just missed them somewhere, to be totally honest with you. I love this armour. I'm really happy with this armour. It's taken me about a year to get the enchanting books together. Um, I've been in, I've, basically, I've been enchanting the enchanting books rather than enchanting. Why is there only one door here? Did I run out of doors? I can't remember. Um, yeah, I've been enchanting the enchanting books rather than enchanting the armor because that way the armor only had one enchant, which means it didn't age as much. Go away. Okay, can we get up from here? Uh, not that way. Being through there. I'm starting to get the feeling that I've explored this entire area, but I know that's not true because I haven't seen that last guardian. Uh, I got to, I got to admire the design as much as it annoys me. I got to admire the design because it's so twisty turny. Uh, which uh, they've done an excellent job of, I think. It's really frustrating working in this area. It really, really does get annoying. So we know there's an up that I can be able to see, but I haven't been able to get into. I thought my potions had run out for a second there. So let's have another crack at trying to get into it. What's about in the middle here? No, that's just a decoration. Down here. What about up here? And feeling I've been up here before but okay come on you okay right we're going we're going to TNT that all right let's uh okay let's take these potions and then we've got the space in the bar Drank that. Drank that. We're down to our last eight minutes of adventure this time round. Okay, so... Alright, let's go and get some TNT, because this is getting silly. I'm sure there's a fairly obvious way through to The Last Guardian. I'm just not seeing it. To be honest with you. Just double check all this area. Can I go up here? I did not go up here. Hello. Hello. Die. Die. Thank you. All. Ah, that's the last guardian. Which means when the mining fatigue wears off, it won't come back. And that means that this temple is now open for exploitation. And I obviously forgot to look up. So what we will do is back here at the start. But I can't get out that way. But did I bring some ladders? Did I leave the ladders behind? Yeah, I probably did, didn't I? Okay, let's 
There we go. A couple of those. Some wood. Let's make some sticks. And just quickly make some ladders. Okay, let's see six ladders. And where should we put them? We shall put them here. So doink, doink. There we go. And back in our airy bit. So it doesn't matter now if the white vision, the water breathing wears off. Let's get this final wet sponge into action and just clear out a little bit more of the water and I'm thinking the place where to clear out the water is probably a good place to do it will be below us so let's do that so we'll just stick it right in the middle there slurp that's got rid of all that water do I still have mining fatigue I do for another minute when that's gone I will get that up and I can actually I'll get them all up and I'm going to start the process of getting the air or the water out of here and you've just seen how I'm going to do it so I won't bother showing you in fact I think what we'll do is we'll leave it there guys right um there you go water temple complete completion in under an hour now all we need to do is go and get the lovely loot so until the next time I've been Simon Parsons this has been Minecraft on the world of Iris thank you and good night.